We're here in San Mateo on the campus of Sarah High School where the Sarah Padres are hosting the De La Salle Spartans. De La Salle, the number one team in Northern California. Should be a great game between these two Northern California powers. But first we head south down to 101 to Mountain View where St. Francis takes on Oak Grove in our Northern California Game of the Week. Strike up the band. It's the home opener for the St. Francis Lancers as they host Oak Grove. Opening kickoff Oak Grove's Dubam Awuzi takes it from the one out to the 22 yard line. Nice return, but the Lancers defense would stiffen on the very first play from scrimmage, forcing a turnover. St. Francis ball at the 18. Lancers in business. Two plays later, quarterback Will Smith. Nice pocket, fires over the middle to Brandon Bishop for the 18-yard touchdown, 7-0 Lancers. Still in the first, Oak Grove's defense steps up. We used to call this a tip drill, and when you intercept the ball, you yell out, Oski, ball right into the hands of Thomas Farfin. Nice play, but unfortunately, that drive would also stall. Second quarter, Oak Grove with their longest play of the night. Quarterback Ray Rivera, deep pass to Cleveland Wallace, great catch, one hand and a helmet but the Eagles will be stopped again. St. Francis with some big plays of their own. Darrell Crooks, how many Eagles does it take to take down a Lancer? Pretty much all 11 of them on this play. Tough, hard run there. That would lead to this. A 33-yard field goal by the Lancers. Nick Gebhardt gets it to go through. 10-0 St. Francis. Just before the half, St. Francis will go deep again. It's Smith to Bishop. They call him Double B, and he makes a spectacular grab. He had two catches for 50 yards and a touchdown. 10-0 St. Francis at halftime. Fast forward to the fourth quarter. St. Francis gives it to Crooks, and this play ignites the crowd. 32-yard rumble by the big man, and that play would set up this. It'll be Lamont McCoy, part of that one-two punch in the backfield for St. Francis. Crooks and McCoy, something that the rest of the league is going to need to watch out for. He dances across the goal line, 17-0, Lancers on top. Late in the fourth quarter, Lancers put it out of reach. It's going to be Crooks again. It's a six-yard touchdown run, 24-0 St. Francis. That is your final score. St. Francis kicks off the 2010 season with a 24-0 win over Oak Grove. We scored 10 points right off the bat, and they kept driving, but our defense was making great stops. And then again, we just we just kept pounding it in there with Darrell and Lamond. I mean, I just I just got the ball and did what I do. I do it every time. I've been doing this all my life, man. I let her run the ball, and I don't think nobody can tackle me. I'm gonna keep that mentality all my life. He has always been a powerful runner. Always, always on the ball. Always carrying hard. Never gets tackled the first time. And the offensive line was just opening lanes for him. He he was just taking advantage of that offensive line, really playing as one. Our defense just came out strong, and we did what we had to do. We came out, executed, running the ball well and it paid off.